It's so stupid, it's positively brilliant. Listen, I saw you make a face when I said the Javante Davis thing. I love Tank. Yeah, Tank's cool. Tank gets busy in the ring. Do you think he was out of line? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah, I called uh, Floyd's baby mama. Melissa, I was like, yo, what happened? He was, she was like, it just happened so fast. He just came and snatched her up. I, I don't, I mean, they're like, that's his mother of his child, but that's not his girl. So I don't Even if it was that. his girl, you, that, no, it was you can't let much. a woman get you to that point. Nah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? To where you're putting hands wrong. on her. Because mm-hmm. if you do that in public, everybody's mind automatically goes to, imagine what he does behind mm-hmm. the clothes. And, and that's, and that's exactly what they said, that. too. And yeah. next thing you know, yeah. you're fucking up your money because now no, nobody wants to do endorsement that's deals with you. And then... God forbid you get a charge, but you ended up getting a charge with domestic violence. So it's just like, it's you don't want that on your record. Yeah. I, that's going to follow him forever. Have you ever had a guy jack you up? No. Well, no, no. no, no, that, no. That, that would never you know what? I would never allow that. <laughs> and I think if it was between forgiving someone that put his hands on me or someone that cheated on me, I would... I'll take I'll the cheating any day. He didn't but, not put hands. I mean, that's still putting hands. Yeah. He didn't hit her. He just... Grabbed her like by the no that was putting hands on. He snatched her. Yeah, he, he, no. he put hands on. And you're yeah, he, that motherfucker's strong. Yeah, like, he yeah, can kill yeah, somebody. Yeah. I mean, yeah. he's one good punch. Oh. But the but the way she reacted showed me like that wasn't the first time that happened. Oh no, she did. She reacted she, like a child who knew yes, that they had gotten caught go. doing yeah. something wrong. And she wrong. came back when it was over and sat down. <laughs> really? There's no. She was really embarrassed from what I heard. She was really embarrassed. I couldn't even. How could you even come back around? You know, and no, no disrespect to white folks, but all them white folks was like, look at that shit. It was just too. It was too. I don't know. She came back and was embarrassed, and but the fact that she came back and sat down and finished watching the game. Taylor hates her, right? And Taylor hates her because um, he took her on a shopping spree. Wait, what? T- 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 Taylor? <laughs> yeah, Taylor right there. Hates who? You said you, you didn't like his baby mama? You didn't like him buying stuff for his baby mama? Gervonta Davis? When did I say that? Oh. You had a whole topic about it on the radio, yes. Okay, so what I ain't asked you to come on the mic. I just said you don't. No, because I need to explain my part. Take that. Okay. Take that. You know, in matter of fact, I haven't used this in a while. Is she the one that wanted to sleep with Serge Ibaka? Or that was funny. No, that well, was you him. Did. We haven't done this in a while. Oh my god. Um. All right. First of all, <laughs> I what? Can you explain what happened though? Because now what? I don't remember. I remember. Javante Davis it. took his baby mama on a shopping spree. No, that's not what it was. Yes, it was. Was and it? we had the conversation: Is that okay for a baby daddy to take his baby mama on a shopping spree? Because he got a whole other girl. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I said it wasn't, hmm. I didn't think it was necessary. I agree. And I didn't say, I didn't, I didn't say that it was, I hated her. Stop putting words in my mouth. <laughs> I said I heard, that I, I, didn't, I didn't think it was necessary. You have a whole nother girl. You don't need to like, I don't. It's, it's okay to like respect your baby mom, but all that gets for a birthday. That's the like, mother of your child. So, so what? Well, not, so? not only that, he's a public person. And when you have a baby with somebody who's a public person, you got to make sure they have security. You got to make sure that they can fly comfortable. Yes. You got to make sure that they're taken care of. You cannot. They are, though. No, so you, why do you have to cherish her with all those? How do you know how she's taken care of? If she's a good one, if she's a good baby mama, please yes. take care of her. That's shower fine. her with gifts. But you shower don't need to. One. No, you don't no. need to shower her. If the her. mother of your child is happy, your child will be happy. Yes. So, so she can be happy with a like happy birthday, a car. No. So Floyd's baby mama, Melissa, drives a ghost or uh, whatever car of the week that she wants. She lives in a big ass house. She's dressed well. She flies, whatever. But, you know, she's not going after him for child support. He's taking very good care of her and his daughter. So wouldn't you want to have a relationship where we don't have to go to the courthouse and fight over That's you right. get 25000 yeah, a but month? Then there has to be a level of respect for the new girl that you're dating. Like, if you're showering her with more gifts than the one that you're with, there's a huge problem no, I, I, there. I, I don't know. And I, on top of that, she that's it. It's over. So yes. the only time that he should be showering is the is the baby. Day. Maybe that's Mother's delicious. Day is the baby, and that's it. I doubt mean, it's the case that he's treating the baby mama better than his new girl. Yeah, but yeah, the new girl is the one that got to learn the rules. I was yes. just, uh, Not the what? baby mama. No. Yeah, I was no just way. about to say, this and is the problem with y'all. Out with the y'all be getting in situations and wanting the man to change and give up everything for you because he's yours. Stop that. Word. It's okay. As long as he can take care of you the way that you need to be taken care of and still uh-huh. keep his daughter or child's household intact with his mom, uh, why not? That hits close home to me because I had to deal with that shit and I didn't like it. It was just complete disrespect. You have There's to no with? need at all uh, for you to, you know, give her the... 
Like I just, I don't, I can't. Do, explain. I will never tease. Ex- explain, Lulu. What happened? He, so my ex has a baby mama, okay. and she was always like very in the way, like always blowing up the phone, wanting to know everything. Like why? That's his baby mama. That's I don't his give mother a fuck if that's the baby mama, but it's over. So your only priority is your kid, and that's it. As long as he's good and you take care of him, and you're a great father, okay. You have no responsibilities at all. For the baby mama. That's not true. The bitch got another dude. So, so, so why why I, do you have to be all up in her life though? Like, can I can I try something? Okay, so in the book, my mother my father was married to his wife. He's still married to his wife for forty five years. They've been married. He had seven kids out of his marriage with five different women. Okay, so with that idea. That's probably the reason why my father was never around because his wife didn't. You, know, you had that kid, but you're not about to go over there and build no home with them. That's fucked up. And because of that, all of us got daddy issues. But that's not what we're saying. We're not that's saying totally that. different. Okay, we're not but for him that. to be in the kid's life, he has to have a respectable relationship with the baby mom. Yes. yes. One thing is you have being to provide respect- for that household. That's still no, that's a house. You have to respect for the baby, for the child, not for her needs. I can't wait till y'all become baby mamas. I can't. No, my dad, right? So we have a half brother. And my mom, the my dad's uh ex or whatever, she was respectful. She never got in the way, but my dad has a great relationship with her. So does my mom. It was done respectfully. You know, my dad didn't have to go and buy her anything. He provided for my brother. I don't even call him a half brother because he's my brother. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But she wasn't blowing up the phone. My dad wasn't if, taking if her on vacation. If she had a flat tire, you know, it's not my dad's responsibility. Go call up the new guy that you're with or call up a Triple brother a. or something. Whatever. That's, that's, that's a question, too. Does he, does he have a uh, boyfriend? Who? The does he have a boyfriend? Uh, I don't know. And see, that's it, too. You'll be okay if... Yes, let make that make sure that nigga get us something. <laughs> but, but said, what yes, <laughs> make sure he get us something, please. Something he's not okay, giving out, he might give yes. you shit. He All right, well, we gotta figure girl. that you out. You don't know that we gonna share stuff. Yep. Or oh, we taking the stuff back? Keep the tags. What on kind it. of car you want, baby? What kind of car we getting? What kind of car Javante buying us? Yes. <laughs> Sorry. First Absolutely. All, my, my man, that seemed, why are you not buying this for me? But why, why do you? But why do you care? If you're already getting yours. Why do you care? Because like, like I guess people I'm look at it like yeah, but that's the that's the problem, and that's why everybody's single but me. Well, you're I mean I mean I'm not you know having broken relationship issues. Like you're married, you guys figured it out. I ain't got time for that. This is too it's too you don't much. Think it's unnecessary at all. No, I think that I mean because I see it. I've actually I have friends who are actually in those situations. I think they take very good care of their families and their baby mom and their kids and all that, but then they also take care of the people that they're with. I'm not saying not, not to take care of them, but there's a fine line that you don't cross. Not when it comes to the mother of your child. Because that's really the mother of your child. That's the carekeeper, the CEO of yeah. your child's life. If you you have to make sure one, she's good. Sure you want her to be care. good mentally, emotionally, sexually. You, you should be able to hit the baby mama off once nah, in a while. Oh, 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 <laughs> I'm just playing. But oh, you, that, okay, then you be that, but I'm not going to be there. No, I'm not going to be. I'm not. Why does the gift have to be? I'm sorry. I'm just saying she's waiting for the white picket fence. I don't know. I don't I understand understand why why you're, we're just talking about one thing. He gave her mad shit for his birth, her birthday. Not necessary. You could give her who? a gift, a nice little like, dinner. That's not doing like making sure she's good. Like that's not making sure she's good. So if a guy showers you with gifts, is that necessary? See, you trying to twist it no, around? I'm just asking the question. I'm not a baby mom. It don't or matter if, like if any guy decides he want to shower you with gifts just because whether he likes you or he's just showing his that's appreciation. Fine, is that but necessary? In that particular situation, that's not what it no, is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. That's the yeah. mother of his child. She earned that. Whether she's getting it in child support every month or he's deciding to take her on a shopping spree, anyway. she earned that. What's the problem? Keep her happy, please. No, there's a level of respect. There's a <laughs> level of respect. Get ugly. I'm then all just about be with her then. Okay. Yeah, you're going to just be with her. her. Okay, y'all need to stop. It is no, not it, it is, that easy. No, it's, but think about it too because the baby mom could easily just twist around like, oh, well, he got me this stuff too. He maybe still likes me and loves me, all this other oh, stuff. Trying, and then you're going to have a new support. man and that new man is going to be living off the, you're the old, it's just too complicated. Do it don't matter. If you Javante Davis and you paying $10,000 in child support to see your baby mama, if she got a man, he got got that yeah. too. Yeah. It don't matter. Pendejo el entonces. Huh? <laughs> What's that mean? That whole ain't what? <laughs> so then, then he's, a dumb, he's a dumbass. Then he's also paying, not only is he paying for the girl that he's with, the baby mama and the baby mama boyfriend, how stupid are you? Well, if the baby yeah. mama's happy, y'all are going to have a lot of peace in your relationship yeah. too. 
Like, could you imagine? What's the opposite? He's now going to court every month with yep. the baby mm-hmm. mama, getting drug over, Mad publicly money. shamed. Can't you ain't shit. Kids. Now she's fucking off his brand. Now he can't get money to take you where mm-hmm. you want to go. Now you don't like that either. You got to pick a side. You want the drama or you want peace? Peace. But he's also setting a whole thing. So she's going to expect that every year for a birth. Like, I don't so know. So what? He's rich. He can yeah, fight. He's like, like, young. Saying, you're putting a, a He ain't perception. even got his big payday yet. He's putting a perception in her in her mind, though. I feel so? like, but somehow, but somehow, you're, you're, but somehow you you all are translating it like th- that's taking something from you. Because that's going to k- cause me out of peace. Like I'm like, well, why are you like? But that's uh, that's your fault. And by the way, if we being honest, you're just a girlfriend. Yeah. If you if you look, wife, looking at the scale, totally damn. baby mamas, damn, take precedent over the girlfriend all day. Oh, where so your baby mom does. I'm not, I got a whole, totally different situation. When you're the girlfriend, you're not thinking like, at least for me, I'm thinking, all right, this is going to lead somewhere else. I'm not thinking it's not going to, it's just, you know, another two months and this, this shit is going to be done. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So I'm not yeah. thinking it like that. And I and listen, I, you got, I said a good baby mama. A good baby mama take care of her before she puts you on child support and deal with what I'm dealing with. Mm-hmm. You got to think most guys, this shit. Are, most guys that got baby mamas, they're keeping everything kosher with the baby mama so they can have a great relationship with the kids. Yes. So if the new girlfriend puts me in a situation where I got to choose either, oh, you're really asking me to choose between my my child you and you. the kid. Not really the baby mama and you. And this is why I'm a good side nigga because I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not fucking up your shit. Okay, the baby needs <laughs> some milk cool your girl need books for whatever she do it cool whatever like I'm gonna help y'all out do that. If, you, if you could do that if you know how to I'm take cool. care and give help give a present yeah. I'll here keep you forever forever you ain't never going nowhere and this is why y'all losing out to us because you so busy dealing with that <laughs> bullshit we over here like what's up <laughs> 